Hey Zio, Coach Nicole. This is my last meal prep tip for you this week. And this week it's about, oops, I forgot to meal prep. Or I just came home from work and I need to make something real quick. I've been busy all day. I don't have any food prepped. You need four things. You need a protein, a carb, a veggie, and some olive oil or some kind of fat. So what we have is a sheet pan meal. You're gonna put all of those things on the sheet, cook it all at the same time. Easy cleanup, I have a pan with some parchment paper. Once you cook it on the parchment paper, all you have to do is throw that parchment paper away. You don't even need to clean the pan. Convenience, easy, clean. I have for protein today, I have some Meyer Cod fillets. So what, these are really cool because they're individually packaged and they're in the freezer. So you can just pull out one package as you need it. I pulled that out earlier today and let it thaw it out and now it's ready. So this is one serving, it's four ounces. So I've already sprayed my parchment paper with some um, olive oil spray. So I'm gonna add my uh, protein to the pan and then I'm choosing sweet potatoes for my carbs so I have a serving of sweet potatoes excuse my Brussels sprout I have a serving of sweet potatoes that I'm going to spread across here this is about a hundred grams it's like one serving four ounces and then I'm doing a serving of Brussels sprouts so you could do like your carbs, you could choose whatever potato you want. I just prefer sweet potatoes and I like to cut them up really thin like little fries. And then I have sweet potato, or excuse me, Brussels sprouts, but green beans, snap peas, peppers, um, roasted carrots, whatever vegetable you like, go for it. So I had already weighed out all of my servings and pre-cut. If you um, already, meal prep in the during the week and you already have sweet potatoes already cut up or you already have vegetables on hand this just makes it that much easier um, i had my brussels sprouts pulled out of the freezer i bought them in bulk and froze them and then pulled them out when i'm ready to make a meal like this and i had a sweet potato left over so i just made my meal in probably less than five minutes as the oven is warming up at 425, I'm getting my sheet ready and cook for about 15 to 20 minutes in the oven at 425, you're good to go. I also like to add some seasoning, so I like to just do some garlic on my vegetables and some pepper. Same thing with um, my, my fish. You guys can decide, you know, whatever seasoning you guys like to use. And then for my for my sweet potatoes and my Brussels sprouts because I need to get my fats in for this meal. I already have my protein, my carb, and my veggie. Now I have to add some fats. Is I take some olive oil. This is a half of a serving. So I put it in this cute little shot glass because that's what I'm using shot glasses for. And I'm just gonna drizzle it over my vegetables and my sweet potatoes. So and then I'm just gonna mix it all together. So it gets nice and evenly coated. You could literally do it with your protein too. You could do chicken, you could do shrimp, you could do whatever protein you choose to do. You can do whatever carb you wanna do. Like I said, I already gave you some suggestions. Everything is all on one sheet, it's all gonna cook together. Everything is all on one parchment paper. Tin foil works fine too. Just make sure you spray it so it doesn't stick. Clean up is super easy once it's done cooking. All you have to do is fold it up and throw it away and you're good to go. So um, I hope this meal prep week was really good for you. You learned a lot. You got a, great, a lot of great tips and you're